welcome back to Redhead Art. Today we're going to be making these hilarious and cute minion weevils. They are such fun and so easy to make. Now, if you'd like to see more minion craft, let me know in the comments and I'll see what I can do. Anyway, let's get started. Okay, so these guys are really easy to make. You will need oh, either a plastic egg in yellow obviously I only happen to have a, a red one lying around but ours are actually made from these capsules these capsules are found in Kinder Surprises now you can't get these in America sorry about that guys so that's why if you're in America you use one of these oh full of chicks this one um, and uh, you just have to add more weight we'll come to that in a minute so you can make them using plastic eggs and they look great using plastic eggs but I really like using um, these uh, containers that you get in surprise eggs now it only takes about two or three minutes to make these now the video obviously is a bit longer because I'm chatting to you and all that kind of stuff but you know it really doesn't take long to make the first thing you will need is your empty uh, container some coins I've used five pence here which is five uh, five one penny pieces and I'm going to take them up now this is to weigh down your little toy a weevil works on center of gravity and um, basically if it's heavier at the bottom it will always try and stand up because of how the gravity and the motion works okay so uh, you can also experiment with this and make it into a real science project and see if you make one without anything inside it and also if you add more coins what happens um, so it's up to you really you'll need some glue if you want to speed up the process you can use a hot glue gun I'm just using ordinary PVA glue here and it's really important that you let this dry this step um, because if your coins don't stick to the bottom of your uh, weeble um, you won't get that standing up effect it will just be a little minion rather than a minion that stands up so you take this you plonk it and you push it down now you can use other coins the problem is that some coins don't fit on the bottom so you do have to have a coin where you know the glue really snugly fits around um, or like I say use a hot glue gun now because we're making this today I can carry on at the end of it I'll just make sure that the, the coins are, are secured but um, you then shut it and you go on to the next step you will need for the next step oh dear <laughs> some googly eyes of your choice um, and a black pen so what I do now is I basically it doesn't really matter exactly where but it happens to be that there's a little line just here and I'm just gonna go around and color this in black like so it doesn't have to be super neat if you've got a nice um, thick black pen that probably is a bit quicker and easier but it's going to be a marker pen. I can put some links below to where you can find googly eyes and marker pens, maybe even some plastic eggs, but you might have some left over from Easter. Like so. It doesn't have to be super neat, like I said. Love this, such a great recycled project and so fun. I actually did a video about this, not, not about these, but with these guys in action about two years ago. This is when I wasn't really YouTubing. And I think it's inspired loads of people to make them because I've seen them as eggs and as minions since, or as um, Kinder Surprise ones since. Now I'm going to, let's see, get some blue paper and cut a strip. It's not an exact size, I'm just guessing. I think this is about a centimetre and a half. And I'm going to cut it a bit longer than I think I'll need it because you can always trim it. Like so. Let's have a look. You need it to fit just underneath the lip of where you're uh, fixing it. So I quite like this length. These are a bit long, I think, um, but this one's quite good because you can still see a bit of yellow at the bottom, and I think that's quite nice. You take a bit of tape, like so. It doesn't matter if it's overlapping a bit because you can then help it stick down a bit. And then you go to the back of your minion, and you want the tape to be at the back. You line it all up, make it as tight as possible and then you tape it down. Now, if you don't like it crinkled, you can um, sh cut it into shape and you can also add a little bit of glue so that the uh, the trousers don't fall down, so to speak. Now at this point, you can either leave them blue or add a little symbol. Um, it's your choice, really. I quite like them just blue, to be honest. I think that makes them look quite sweet. I still have my glue stick and I'm gonna make, I think, a minion with two eyes. Now, if you've got something like a silver pen, you could also add some, you know, some goggle details in silver but um, I'm just going to keep it nice and simple, like so. And you can also add, um, you know, at the top, you can also add some little hairs, like so. 
And there you have your super simple minion. Aren't they adorable? Obviously, watch them at the beginning wobble, watch them at the end of the video wobble. But in the meantime, I'd like to invite you to subscribe to the channel. I'd like you to comment below and tell me, do you want more minion crafts? Do you want some other crafts? What do you like seeing best? Please come and tell me. Anyway, I'll say goodbye now and I'll leave you with some wobbling minions. Bye! Okay, one quick look at how they weeble and wobble and stand up. Now, if you like this craft, give me the thumbs up, leave me a comment and let me know if you'd like to see some more minion crafts. Anyway, see you soon. Bye.